All right, this authenticity nugget is courtesy of Corey Steer, my boy on LinkedIn, who sent me a question. I'm going to read it. What is the best way to give permission to someone who may be struggling with how to be authentic in your conversation with them? We don't want to be authentic because it makes us vulnerable and we're scared. So someone needs to make it safe. And that's where leadership comes in. Whether it's a conversation, whether it's an organization, we require leaders to go first. I know there's a lot of talk about leaders going last. When it comes to authenticity, leaders go first. They set the tone. They do it half-hearted, they're going to get a half-hearted response or even worse. But if they really lean into it, they get really vulnerable. They don't pretend they have all the answers. They don't cover their weaknesses. They're real with you. You will feel safe and you will respond in a way that normally you would not be comfortable doing. So if you're a leader, lean into it. Be authentic and you'll inspire a level of authentic uh, connection that you never thought was possible.